Should he be wherever you are on this uh, most pleasant evening? There has been a clamour to get inside the ground tonight for a much anticipated game. The uh, roads outside of the stadium have been bumper to bumper with traffic. The car parks are full. There is a torrent of humankind making its way from the nearby station and we expect every seat to be filled an atmosphere of uh, great expectation and excitement and we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena absolutely picture perfect for a game of this nature to what we've been told, this is how it looks. It's a 4-3-3. Yes, and the importance of this formation is not to allow the midfield three and the attacking three to become too detached from one another. If that happens, then pressure can quickly be applied via the counter-attack and you can be exposed defensively. So compactness can't be compromised. And you need talkers in this team. You need leaders and people that are willing to organise things very quickly. There's the whistle, and here we go. So, Jim, tell me this, who are you looking for in particular here? Yeah, Milinkovic Savic. I'll be keeping an eye on his long-range shooting, Peter, because that's um, something he does with real prowess. The stuff that makes the highlight reels, of course, but he also does a lot of good work under the radar, recycling the ball, pressing opponents, and generally bossing midfield. Yes, he'd be my pick too. It's going to be all about how they get the best out of him. And it's Patel. Chiesa opts to play it back. He's had the hit one! Goal! Fiorentina! Lovely goal, perfect poise to set himself for the strike. Fiorentina ahead, one goal to the good. Lulic. Well, there's a lot of movement out wide now. Yeah, we can certainly see that. Well, I think it's a move to open the game up more, whether out wide or, or just getting a runner through the middle now. Tries to stroke it through. Pinged one through here. Boateng. Not much subtlety. He's launched himself there. Lucas very firm in standing his ground there. It is a tough full contact contest. Patel. Fiorentina are very much in charge here. Dominating possession and a goal to the good. Well, that's where he wants it. Uh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Patel. There has been just the early goal here, and it's 1 0. Tries to get it forward quickly to the keeper and go again. Forward it goes. Across the field it goes. Luis Alberto. Hit long and direct. Can he deliver? Luis Alberto. Well, they could break here. And the referee brings the first half to a close. And here we are, off they go for half-time. The breakthrough did indeed come in the first half. 
but there has only been that one goal, which is very, very tight. Well, you obviously have to give credit to the front end for the half-time lead, but I think the midfield can really pat themselves on the back too. They work tirelessly for me. Fiorentina head into the dressing room, pleased with the thought that they have that all-important lead. Analysis to come during the break. And the game has already resumed here. Well, it's been tight, Peter, but I'm expecting things to, to open up now and we get some free-flowing football. Patel. Fiorentina just about have their noses in front. It is the slenderest of leads. Chiesa. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Look, he's offering an apology to his teammate, who's clearly miffed at not being picked out despite making what looked like the right run. Is up and the counter is on. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, this lead is beginning to look a little delicate. I'd rather see them shut. Shut a goal! <laughs> Two up and threatening to pull clear. And looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Fiorentina take a lead and things should be comfortable from here on in. Well, at 1 0, this con. Well, that's a foul. Free kick's been given. But Dell can get it clear. And it's Correa. And here's Lulic. Chiesa. Out towards the flank. What a throw in. Luis Felipe. Ahead by two and just about into the home straight. Boateng. He's looked long this time. Ah, oh, he'd have done well to reach that. Lazio are making a change now. Well, he's worked so hard for his side, uh, as you would expect, but you couldn't help notice that he was starting to, to labour a bit, so it's no surprise. Confirmation that there will be two minutes stoppage time. the final whistle. Fiorentina gain victory here and on balance they were worth it. The final thoughts, Jim? Yeah, looking back on this, the early goal had a big influence on what unfolded and allowed them to dictate with comfort. Well, thanks to Jim, we both wish you a very good evening. <laughs>